Okay, I'm not sure how well this is going to take, but here's your entry from the friend side. There's your garage. Go through the friend's entry. Let's see if I can zoom out. There we go. Your mud room. Utility room. Towards the living room. To the left we have your powder bath. And to the right your pantry. Got the window in the back. We we'll come in and now we're in your kitchen. Look at those openings. That's gonna all be glass doors. Aren't you gonna love that? There's your dining room. Uh oh, look what's there. There's Slade's pet door. We're gonna pan back to your kitchen. And the fridge is gonna be on the right. On the left is, I don't know, that's where the TV's gonna go for your cameras. That's gonna be a brick arch with brick walls all the way in here for the kitchenette. And then, here's the cubby for under the stairs. Let's see if I can get a light on. Nope, I don't know if you're gonna see. But we have that space and all underneath that whole office space. It's a five foot ceiling under there. And then there's another space there. But I can come in here and I can almost stand up. That's your Christmas storage and your cottages and stuff that need to be a seed and then the living room and a fireplace up top those two squares are the slotted diffusers for the HVAC vents we didn't have any other way to put them in the ceiling so we put them there we'll go here's your entryway this whole wall here is going to be brick. This is your front door. Out your front porch. Then here's your front door right into your entry. That whole wall is going to be brick and I even put three lights up top to spotlight or downlight either something that we paint on the brick or art then there's your stairs and your office and again look at all that glass I'm back looking at your kitchen from the living room and then this goes down the hall to the guest rooms with the hall closet the entry into guest room one. We have a cathedral ceiling. The bed wall. And we go through the bathroom as a vanity. There's guest room's closet with a window. Ooh, I don't have lights. Sorry. That's the shower. It's got a window. That window and the closet window, those will all get frosted um, laminations on them. And the toilet, yep, big black hole. And here's vanity for the guest number two and guest number two bedroom. And guest number two closet. TV, 
and back out the hallway back there's your entry we just did a circle and then here's your hidden room I've got the equipment rack is gonna go here I put your breaker panels here so you don't have to go out to the garage or anything if anything happens got an attic access up there and then at the end I'm gonna put a safe for your guns and then this door sorry no lights and really can't turn that on can I this is your master closet yep nice seeing it huh and then that leads <laughs> to your toilet oh no, you can't see your toilet and then your your bathroom <laughs> Uh, well, there's where your vanity's going, and there's your <laughs> shower. <laughs> oh, but you can see your master ba bedroom, the bed wall, the windows, the ceiling, your TV wall, and then just outside the bedroom as we come circle around, you got the door that goes to the back porch. in the hallway with some sconces and then back in the living room. Your house does a bunch of circles. I'm gonna go upstairs. There's your office. And you got these floor to ceiling windows here. And a second window there. That's a miniature closet. We had some issues, but we're gonna hide that door actually in some paneling also. It's gonna be pretty cool. And then here, you need to tell me if you want a built-in desk or a standalone desk and built-in cabinets. Jill asked that question, I didn't know what to tell her. Obviously, the least expensive is a built-in desk. Climb the stairs. I gave attic access right at the top of the stairs. Walk in, there's your water heater, air conditioning unit, and then, well, all your foam insulation is in. Back out, and this enters into the game room or a large guest suite. Got a storage closet for games and whatnot. In the game room, cathedral ceiling. TV wall, big window. Looks out onto the backyard. Look at that, it's oaks. One and two. Look at those ones right over there at the top. Big ones. Yep, can't see my house from up here. Back through the game room. Come in here, we have a large linen. And the bath. Vanities, toilet, and the uh, shower tub will be there. And then exiting out of the game room. We'll go down the stairs. Go tour your garage, your back porch. I'll probably put this up on YouTube so that you can click the link. So you walk out your back porch pan over here you got the TVs beyond that wall there's those trees from the window up there there's uh look real hard after that corner you can see about part of my pool there's a view from the outside and over here's where your outdoor kitchen is there's your water and stub out. So from that post, ah, 
from that post over there will all be cabinet and then L shape back over there to where your sink is. So you'll have countertop, grill, under counter fridge, and then the sink. There's Danielle's house over there. Uh, there's the back of my house over there. So we'll go in through the dining room windows now. Through the kitchen. Past your fridge. Out into the garage. Nine foot garage doors. Your central vac's gonna be in this corner here. Your front doors are in. Came in today. Water softener. Your entry door. Your friend's entry door. I got it to match the front door. And there's a boogie snack. Central vac for vacuuming your car in the garage. And one surprise over here by the water softener. This right here shuts all your outside valves off. So during a freeze, all you have to do is come outside, flip that valve right here, just like that, and then go open one faucet outside and let it drain, and you have no water, no, no pipes, nothing to wrap outside. Turn it back on. So, and then out your garage, there's our house, and there's big oaks. The driveway will come right up to about where that corner and those tire tracks are, and that's where Boogie wants his basketball goal, right at the end of that drive, driveway in front of them oaks. And then we do line of sight down here. The driveway curves in down the street, and like I said, we're back where we started with your friend's entry. All right, signing off. Bye.